today, Max? I'm a little too young for that. I appreciate that. <laughs> so you must be really old. <laughs> oh, I'm really old. <laughs> well, what a difference today, Max. 24 hours. Just get hot on the turnaround. I thought that it was exactly what we needed. And you know, we start doing things right. We started putting pucks at the net. We started getting bodies at the net, and we always talk about. And then it was the same thing in a playoff series, right? If you lose the first one, it doesn't matter if you lose in overtime. Yeah. You get beat by ten goals. Yeah. It's game. It's one game. Yeah. And for us, is we had to keep that in perspective. It was one game. It wasn't a very good game for us, and that we had to be better. Talk about Griffin Arnhouse. Uh, you know what? I'm not going to say Griff came in tonight and played well. Griff didn't have any help last night. And the bottom line is, is if you're not helping your goalie and you're exposing them to high quality shots, any goalie in the league is going to struggle. Well, you referred to bounce back. Whether he had help or not, he had a face that was he had an understanding that he was going to go back in the net, and it was his net uh, to lose. Uh, speak on Nagy, uh, just uh, a demon uh, on the forecheck tonight. He plays extremely well when we play teams from Saskatchewan. <laughs> right? And that is, you know, I think there's there's a lot there. You know, being from Saskatchewan, playing midget in Moose Jaw, and, and, a lot of history there, right? Yeah. And, and uh, it, that's the way he has to play every night to be an effective player. And when he's doing that, he's creating time and space for uh, the guys he's playing with. You have to be pretty happy with the starts that you had each period. What was the message there for when the guys were coming out on the ice? Be better than we were last night. Right? And, and that was something that we we wanted to make sure. And we talked about. We started here in the second period. We started with a five on three. We wanted to try and get a strike. So the initial dial in is win the face off, get your play going. So guys are excited to be out there. And, and then the next thing is, is in the third period, you know, we wanted to play the game the right way. We wanted to make sure that we were ready to go again. Hey, what a difference uh, a day makes. Uh, just yeah. explain the turnaround. Oh yeah, well, I mean, last night was definitely a bit of an embarrassing showing and it was a tough night for us, but uh, the, the talk in the room was that we got to have a playoff mindset, you know, you play back-to-back -back games in playoffs, you got to forget about the game that happened the night before and just move on and every day is a new day, so that was our mindset coming into the game tonight and I thought the guys did a great job of moving on and, and coming out to play tonight. Like you had all day in the slot there on your goal, did you feel like uh, you were in slow motion? Yeah, I felt like I had a little too much time almost. I mean, uh, I was lucky enough to catch that puck and get it down. And I was actually going to pass it, try to pass it back door to Nagy, but then he got covered. And then once that happened, I just, you know, kind of blanked out and just shot it. One of the best it. players, Bert, coughed up some puddling. No, I mean, you know, it's, stuff like that happens. It's yeah. part of the game. So, yeah. he, you know, he's definitely a great player. He's making some good plays out there. So, uh, you know, I, I just got lucky on that one. Uh, well, tell me a little bit about your guys' four check tonight. You guys made a point that you're going to be in their face, in their end. That you yeah, well, we definitely wanted to have a, a lot more jump in, the, in our game tonight than we did it last night and uh, you know I thought we did that for sure. Uh, four check was going, you know, we we're getting guys and buck, pucks and bodies to the net, which is a big thing that we were talking about, about last night that we didn't do. And overall, I thought we just, you know, brought the intensity level up a lot more and just had a good game. Everybody bounced back on the team, it, it seemed like uh, outhouse team facing all those uh, goals last week. Really bounced back tonight. This is his full credit for that shutter. I wasn't like a 12 shot. So yeah, I know he was great for us. You know, I look, you know, that's what that's what we asked for him to, you know, give us a good. Like, have a good game and give us a chance to win and he definitely did that. Uh, I don't know how he made some of the stops that he did and you know overall I think the whole team played great but uh, you know he definitely was, was the key tonight. It felt like you had six of the ten shots in the first period. Your line was very good on the forecheck tonight. What is it about you guys that make you play well off each other? Yeah well I mean I've been playing with blocks for quite a while now and you know I've been uh, having some games with Nag so we, we got some chemistry going and you know, at the start of the game tonight, we really just want to keep it simple, you know, forecheck them as hard as we can, try to create turnovers, and I thought we did a pretty good job of that, and like you said, got a few chances. Tell me, uh, there's no song about what a difference a day makes. Uh, you always say you got a that mindset as a goalie. Yeah. Yesterday behind you, today's a few day, and it was. Yeah, it was, uh, it was good to have a bounce back for us, and 
I think that's what we needed overall. I think every single person in the room played better today, and uh, that's what we're gonna need. It's a playoff mindset. If you lose one, you gotta get back. You gotta get back the next one. Have you seen the puck uh, a lot better tonight, or what was the difference between tonight and last night for you? Um, you know, it's I saw the puck well yesterday. It was more of a save selection thing. It was just one of those off days. You're gonna have them. But, and, Obviously I wasn't good last night and uh, for me I just need to make sure I bounce back to this. Well, it was a team game last night and the whole team wasn't uh, like they were today. Today was a complete bounce back for the entire bank time. Yeah, you know, uh, I think everyone played like we wanted to be here, so uh, that's important. Like I said, it's a playoff mindset. If you lose one, you got to win the next. Um, tell me about your guys' forecheck. It made your job a lot easier tonight in that they had to work for the chances and they had to work 200 feet to get back off the ice. Uh, you guys made a point of just being in their face all night. Yeah, definitely. Uh, we were solid defensively. And when they were, put, when they were tipping pucks in, we were, we were doing a good job of uh, getting in the corners and winning our battles. So I think for us, winning our battles is one of the biggest things that we need to make sure we're doing day in, day out. The battle in front of the net looked like it got heated a couple times, which you know in front of there. What, what was different about tonight with your defenders and how they played in front of you? Yeah, definitely guys were letting me see the puck. That's, uh, that's one thing. We were limiting chances. I mean, 36 shots, but not a ton of chances. They're, they're keeping stuff to the outside. So I think that was the biggest change in our game today. Uh, tell me about this workload of people in these, uh, the number of games you played this year, which is insane. Uh, how is the body holding up? Uh, fine. I'm feeling better after games than I did yesterday, uh, last year. So, I mean, I've worked lots with Corey and uh, Kim up there. So, you know, we're just keeping my body in check. And, making sure I'm hydrated all the time. What did you say to McGann last night uh, when you went back in the game and you grabbed him? Uh, I just kind of told him, you know, it, it happened. There wasn't anything you could do. He was uh, tossed in a tough situation. And a couple of uh, the team wasn't playing great in front of him. Our defense was lacking a bit. So, you know, I felt bad for him there. And he's a great goalie. Definitely can play at this level. And he's going to be a great goalie in this league. And for him, it was just an unlucky bounce. A couple of unlucky bounces.